And this morning we're talking about an event where you can try some great food and help raise money for a good cause at the same time. Top uh, restaurants and local celebrities are teaming up for the annual Men Who Cook competition. The event will raise money for child abuse victims and we're being joined by the executive director of Hope House, Thomas Mitchell, uh, to get more on this. And uh, you guys have been doing this for how many years now? This is our 10th year actually uh, doing Men Who Cook and it's a, just a wonderful event that raises uh, funds to be able to support our cause and support our mission. And the last time I, you, you were in, I asked you why is it just men who cook, women cook, obviously. Yes, always uh, you with the, the difficult you didn't like questions. <laughs> yeah. uh, so we, you know, we started this to really empower men uh, within our community to, to take a stand against child abuse, which is often seen as, as perhaps a women's issue or uh, you know battered women and standing up for, for kids. Uh, so we wanted to kind of reverse that trend. So that and, men care too. Yeah. yeah, absolutely. Men care too and that men can stand up and, and protect our kids. So we could kids. actually call this, and I was telling you this, we could call it men who cook and care. Absolutely, yes. We're going to trademark it, uh, <laughs> Eric's. Uh, <laughs> there you go. Yeah. Uh, and and uh, now, how, how, how many? How do you? Is the competition still open? Yes. Uh, so it'll it'll take place on Sunday, November sixth. You can buy tickets at cachopehouse.org uh, event section. Um, but it's thirteen celebrity chefs paired with thirteen amazing restaurants preparing exquisite dishes. Um, patrons can come and try all of the dishes, wine, beer, and it raises money to support our cause of ending child So abuse. who are some of your celebrity chefs? Uh, well, we have Shane Mutter, uh, who, who's in the kitchen who's this morning. Be featured uh, here momentarily with Pyre Provisions. Um, we also have uh, Daniel Munn and Chifunctas. You know, Chifunctas is an amazing restaurant on the North Shore. Greg Cromer uh, with Nathan's Restaurant yeah. in Slaudel. It's all just, just high-end, amazing food. It's like going out on a date night and trying 13 just amazing restaurants all in one night. And what does it cost to get in? It's $70 uh, for a single or 125 for a couple. But you eat the whole night, right? Whole night, wine, beer, uh, fun, entertainment. Um, we have a great band playing. It's going to be awesome. And it's important to help Hope House. And, and tell for people who don't know, tell people what Hope House does. Yeah, so Children's Advocacy Center Hope House, we work to end the cycle of child abuse in our community. Anytime there's any crime against a child, that child is brought to Hope House. So we work with the police. Um, you know, Mandeville PD, for example, will bring children with the family and we'll do the one, we are the people who collect uh, the evidence through the interview and provide therapy free of charge. And how long has Hope House been around? Since 1994. I was going to yeah. say, you guys have been, been around for a while. And this is a great event. It's a lot of fun. It is. And this is going to be where? It is at the top level of the Justice Center in downtown Covington. Sounds weird to have an event on the Justice Center parking garage. Um, but it's like a starry night. It's really, really nice. Um, it's just a, a immaculate gala. All right. Yeah. Well, hopefully, hopefully the weather holds out for you guys. The Menu Cook competition is on Sunday, November 6th. as. Uh, we just heard uh, in Covington. It'll be on the rooftop of the Justice Center parking garage. All the money raised for the event will go to the Children's Advocacy Center Hope House. We have a link to where you can get tickets on our website, wwltv.com. Just look under the links tab, and in a little while, we'll be in the kitchen uh, cooking some good food. Certainly.